What's up guys, we are Avio. And to celebrate our new release on Refield Recordings, we're gonna show you some quick tips that we used in TextMe. Um, so the first tip is going to uh, be regarding the lead. Uh, it's, a, um, it's a very simple lead. We can show you how it sounds without any effects on it. Um, so without any effect, it sounds like this. So for the lead, we start with an OTT. So without any effect, it sounds like this. And then we add OTT to get a bit more crisp. Uh, we use CamelFed to also add a little bit more crispness. And then we refer to really um, give, the, give the sound more space. And then we use two more OTTs. And I think we both set it to like 35% uh, depth and the, and the last OTT 11. Um, yeah, and then we have a, a compressor. Yeah, a multiband compression, uh, which add a lot to the sound. And then some endless smell and that's, that's basically it. So it comes from, from this. All the way to this. So tip number two is uh, chop up vocals. Uh, so this is the vocal for we used uh, that we used in Text Me. Just text me. And we chopped it up a little bit to um, it's just create like a, a different kind of drop with not like a, a synthesizer or anything like that, just to use like the vocal chop and put that back in the drop. So this is uh, what it sounds like without any effect. And we use a lot of effects, camel fat, reverb, um, a bit distortion to make it crispy. And after that, it sounds like this. It's a lot more powerful. And in a drop with all the effects, it sounds like this. Just text me. Uh, so the third tip is uh, regarding the pads. So we use um, the typical Nexus pad, um, which sounds like this. So this is it without the gate. It's a little bit boring. And then with the gate, it sounds like this. To give like a, a really trancy vibe to the track. Uh, and it suited well. So that's tip number three. So this is tip number four. Uh, we're going to show you how we made the focal in Text Me. Um, this is the focal with and without any effects. And it's, uh, the focal is from Splice, just a sample. Yeah, we had to pitch it up one. Uh, and can you hear the me? The yeah. So uh, we wanted to uh, sound like uh, a bit of a male voice. So we put on a little altar boy. And you can turn the, the format a little bit down so it sounds more lower. Yeah, people, and can like you this. Hear me and after that, we put a uh, wave shaper on it to make it sound more uh, distorted. Yeah, people, and, can you and of course, the reverb. And all together, it sounds like yeah, this. People, and can you hear me so there you have it. That's the focal. Yeah, it makes me. So this is tip number five. This is a trick we use a lot of the times in, I think, all of our tracks. Um, we use it on the focal here and on the lead. So what we do is um, we have the lead sound and it sounds like this. And to give it some extra energy to like really suck in that uh, reverb, we put like a, a reverb that it's just a fruity loop standard reverb, but we like throw everything on there and then the wet completely down. And then in the, um, in the in the song we make an automation clip to really boost it up to the very end till the next note starts so we don't use a compression on it because now you have like full hands on on the on the reverb and it sounds like this it's so much energy yeah it gives a lot of energy and we do the same thing on the focus so here you see 
the focal chop, uh, and also we we draw in the the refurb. And we, you have like you can see it on the screen. It's very like full. You have full control on the on the refurb, and we love to do that. So it sounds like like this, and without the refurb, is it this one? I think the other one, the last one. Oh, it's the last one. Alright, it's the last one. And then we also put it down like a little over half to uh, to have like less of an effect, but it's still very it's still very energetic. So there you have it, that was tip number five, and we hope to see you next time and make sure to listen to text me on Spotify and all your portals. See you Cheers later. guys!